Oh, you guys look like shit. So we're talking about what has worked for us in studying for finals. Because today is our last day of class, which means now we're officially in finals mode. Um, this is my friend, by the way. And, um, okay, so for me, what has worked uh, for me getting my best grades was uh, study groups. I got, well, let me preface this by saying small study groups. I don't think groups over like four people work because then you start to run into like too many voices, but I'll get into that more later. So for me, it's like, it's study groups and uh, going over the professor's old exams. What's worse for you? Okay. So I think getting outlines early on and then you adding to them <laughs> throughout the semester in your class helps a lot. And um, definitely talking it up. I think yeah, talking with people really, really helps. <laughs> Shut up. Yes. Okay. So basically, well, we're basically you... saying that cheating helps in a nutshell. <laughs> <laughs> Which is not true. Lie, cheat, and steal. Lie, cheat, and steal, but get outlines early and use them. I mean, why, re why reinvent the wheel every time, right? Agreed. But add to them. Add your own, like, add the, perspective, the professor's perspective, like, as you go along. Yeah, because a lot of professors care a lot about, like, new issues that have come up that year, like public policy issues. So, um, so it's actually important to add to old outlines. Like, if you pull up an outline from, like, 2002, it's not going to have as much relevance. Um, so, anyways, that's all. <laughs>